up in lights, he just wants to be heard Whether it's the beat of the mic, he feels so This video goes back to the video I made on how to get Virtual DJ Pro 7 Some people ran into trouble on the inbound and outbound rules So I'm gonna explain that to you first and show you how to do that Basically what it does is that it stops uh, Virtual DJ 7 from getting access to the internet because if it makes some kind of connection with the internet it will know that the serial has already been used and it will um, tell you that the serial is uh, invalid so we don't want that that's why we create the inbound outbound rule um, so I'm gonna show you how to do that just follow along and I'll try to make it as simple as possible so the first thing you want to do is open up Windows firewall if you can't find it just uh, type it in the search bar so yeah it'll show up something like this click that and then over here it says advanced settings so you want to click on that you'll get something like this and then over here it says inbound rule first you want to do the inbound rule and click on that then you want to go to new rule then over here it asks you what kind of um, new rule you are making you want to click on program and hit next and then you're going to click on this program path and then so you probably come up with something like this um, program files virtual dj and then you just want to click on virtual dj pro and click on open and hit next and then you want to click on block the connection remember not allow the connection block, block the connection and then hit next and then just select all those hit next and then you if you want to create an, uh, then create a name for it and description so that you know what kind of program that you have blocked just hit finish already already done that and then we're going to do the same thing for the outbound rule new rule program next program path virtual dj pro next next block the connection next that name and boom that's it so that's all you gotta do guys it's very simple i may um I forgot to mention that in the tutorial I made on how to get it. I should have done that so that people didn't get confused or if people were confused there's something to refer to. So sorry about that but you can always uh, refer to this video if you don't understand it and I'm pretty sure it helped a lot of you out there so yeah. If you ever want to create an inbound or outbound rule for another program you can use the same um, way that I showed you on how to block virtual DJ Pro 7 so that's it guys this is the response to that video and I will see you guys next time